We are here at the Nest press conference and I'm showing here Lionel with his new thing. His new go. Nest. Okay, and there is something new to be mentioned. And we're going to take a look at that. We're going to do the demo in a little bit, but uh, first let's ask Lionel, what's new, about, uh, what's new about this device? So we have a brand new design for the third generation. We are supporting open therm and modulation. We also improved a lot of things on the user experience. For example, we have fast sight, which is showing you information across the room, like the temperature all the time. The thermostat is a clock now, yeah. uh, and we also have the support for hot water tank. So if you have a hot water tank in your home, uh, we can control it from a single device. So the best is getting better in many ways, mm -hmm. uh, saves you energy, programs itself, and now support open therm for modulating your water. Okay, so it's uh, version free. Um, from the outside, you um, see that the, uh, that the display is about 40% bigger and it's higher resolution. He calls it, uh, what did you call it? It's a higher resolution display, yeah. but it's like the retina display is coming yeah, to retina the Retina display for, uh, for everything. So it's, the, the device actually is not bigger, it's about the same size. But, um, and it has the same user interface and there's a lot of uh, things we can uh, get. So, you say for the... Uh, you say for the Dutch, oops. You say for the Dutch market, uh, open firm is really important. I thought uh, open firm was a European standard, but uh, you say the Dutch are the ones who uh, have been adapting that uh, the most. Oh, open firm is pretty much everywhere in the Netherlands, and it was a huge request from our customers in the Netherlands. So yeah. uh, we decided to bring that feature first for the Netherlands, but also because we believe in open firm and open protocols. It works in Belgium, it works in France, and it works in the UK. Yeah. But this market are less advanced as the Netherlands oh, in terms of we gas Dutch, water. we Dutch are so advanced. Anyway, <laughs> open firm is that you don't have zero or 100%, but you can do 50% uh, capacity or 20%. And if it's a little bit, if it's not too cold, you can uh, do with less energy. So it's a very natural way to use it. And it's been introduced in the Netherlands first because you think the Dutch are, are they more advanced using this kind of stuff? Or is the energy market more advanced? Or, uh... The thing, it's your installer. It's uh, the manufacturers of gas boiler in the Netherlands, like Remea, that are more advanced than what you saw in, in continental Europe. So you have an install base of open Therm and modulation that is very prevalent. Mm -hmm. um, again, when we launched the second generation a year ago, we wanted to focus on the first thing, which is the end user and making sure that the thermostat was properly programmed mm -hmm. because that's the only way we could save on energy. And now we are getting you know the best of both worlds we have a fantastic thermostat talking to your fantastic boiler yeah. and, and combining the power of the two okay so we have this now we now support the standards in europe one other thing it's now doing is managing the water temperature which is also something uh, you can boost the water if you have your kids uh, showering and it will turn off hot water when you're going away right that's another set of features yeah if you have a very big home in the netherlands and you have a hot water tank so so a cylinder, I think the word in Dutch is boiler. Mm -hmm. uh, if you have this, we can control and you can schedule and you can boost. Yeah. If you have a combi boiler on open therm, you can change the temperature of hot water. So comes the summer and you want the hot water to be less hot, you can do that from the Nest thermostat or the Nest Is it self-learning too or you have to do it yourself? You have to do it yourself because hot water has a strong latency and is more predictable than your heating schedule. Okay, so uh, how many uh, uh, Nest uh, thermostats are there in Holland now? Well, I can tell you worldwide we have millions of them and we don't give a number in the Netherlands but we are super pleased by all the okay. retail But I mean, Holland have. is normally 2% of the market so if you have millions, one million is 20,000 in the Netherlands. If you have millions, it means you have more than 50,000 here in the Netherlands. I can't comment on that. Okay, so there's 50,000 people who now have uh, <laughs> something like that. I mean, they, there is a bunch of people who have Nest thermostats and they don't have open firm. How, they, uh, how should they upgrade to this version? Well, for most of them, you know, they can keep the second generation and still enjoy savings. If you want to upgrade to the new version, you have to pay 249 euros and get it replaced and installed by the new one. Okay, so it's like a phone. You just, the new phone, new thing, uh, update and give the other one to the neighbors. It's like a phone, but in some ways, you know, it's saving you energy, so it should pay for itself in a few years. So uh, it's the gift that give, give, continue on, okay. on giving. There's no upgrade program. You just give it to the neighbors and... Uh, Get, let them go to uh, the second uh, generation. Um, there's also integration, you were saying there's integration now of other developers, right? You have 11,000 developers and one of them you only called one. 
uh, I think Yale, the, the key uh, manufacturers, you can open your door with uh, from the Nest uh, app, right? So we have two things. We have a developer program that is 11,000, mm -hmm. and we actually have more than 100 integrations like Bosch, like Philips Hue, like Whittings, my folks playing with it, or Mercedes. And we have also brand new technology called NestWeave, which is a communication that allows objects to object communication in the home. And the first partner that we have is Yale uh, in the US and a lock. Uh, and more are to come in 2016 because that technology will be open. And next year, when we have more information, we'll release more information and grow the ecosystem. Okay, so that will be nice to have. Things like Ring. Do you know Ring from the United States? They have a uh, doorbell, and uh, you can you can uh, and you can open the door from there. It would be. In, are they also a partner? You know that? Well, you know we open to everybody, so I don't know by uh, Ring.com. By, yeah. by okay. head, so we'll everybody see, yeah. that is present on the eleven thousand, but they, they they are more than welcome to join if they want to. Okay. So this was the new things about uh, the third third, third generation of Nest. Uh, I'm going to take an in-depth view now of the menus. So this is the uh, traditional screen. I can heat it up. And here we go. So as you increase the temperature, you can see the shade of orange in the background that is getting. Uh, yeah, the kettle has to work harder. The CV has to work harder yeah. the if the temperature and, becomes. And we are losing the battery, so uh, we need to recharge the thermostat if we want to continue that video. <laughs> okay, the battery is still dead. I'm um, going to do a separate movie about uh, the Nest uh, demo.